Hello and welcome back to Nether Survival, where in this episode we are continuing on our diamond quest. And in front of me, I have a Bastion Remnant, which we are going to go ahead and loot. I've done a little bit of work off camera, I have uh, slayed some Hucklins, uh, hunted, killed, well, made a furnace, cooked them up, and yeah, we shall now continue on in our quest. I am hoping in this episode to get the final diamonds that we require. Uh, speaking of diamonds, I need really, really, really need to make um, another, another, um, what's it called? Ender chest, because I have five diamonds on me and I don't want to die with five diamonds on me. That would be tragic. So I'm hoping to be able to get an enderman today, uh, make an ender chest and get the remaining 13 diamonds. It should be doable, so I'm probably going to cut a lot more and only, literally, only showing when I'm getting loot from chests, and there's one right there. In fact, all right, cool. Let's get uh, let's get to opening it. Uh, there's a gas right there. Okay, yes, I'm going to cut a lot more just because I want to get to the good stuff of getting the the actual loot and such. So that is what's gonna be happening in this episode. Anyways, let's see what we got. We got that. We got some iron nuggets. Nice. Crying obsidian. Not as important. We got arrows and we got iron nuggets. More arrows. A golden helmet is actually really nice for me because I actually don't have that. So that's good. An enchanted book with soul speed 3. Good. But, yeah, I'm sorry. Just not good enough. I'm sorry. Uh, I guess I'll take the crying obsidian. Even though that isn't even that important. Uh, I'm gonna leave the furnace. I was about to open the chest. That would have been really bad for me at this point in time. I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna actually smelt these uh, horse armor here while we're at it, just to get the nuggets. I guess I'll take the soul speed book, and then I'm gonna grab the hopper, and I'll be back on my way. Would you look at that? There's an enderman right here. So if I just get down here into this cave where he is and I dig in like this I should be able to hey buddy uh. hey buddy should be able to kill him here he has a friend outside too which I now have to go kill because he didn't drop me what I needed he's gonna die on his own ender pearl? no ender pearl all right found another chest here Let's see what it got while well, it's just dropping its items down. Let's just double check down here. Nope, got nothing. All right, move aside, please, sir. What do we have? All right, a gold block, string, and iron nuggets, and magma cream. All right, found another one. Really cool. Uh, same procedure. Oh, okay, I guess not the same procedure. My pickaxe broke. Not good. Let's see if we get anything good. Uh, I guess I could exchange my crossbow. I guess I could do that. Yeah, I'm gonna exchange my crossbow. I might as well. Because there are a lot of hucklins here. But I did find a chest down here, so we are gonna see what it contains. Hopefully, without getting into trouble with... Uh... Oh, there's a gold block. Will I be able to get that without certain people getting angry at me? I think that was a mission success. <laughs> uh, it's creepy doing that. Okay. Uh, I can't open the chest. Well, I probably can, but there are piglins around, so I'd rather not. Cooked pork chop. What do we have here? Golden hoe with silk touch. I'm gonna grab that. Alright. A glowstone. Can I use that for anything right now? Uh, I guess I could duplicate my arrows, but duplication is really not what I need in my inventory right now. So I think I'm gonna pass on uh, on the glowstone there. I could duplicate my arrows to be spectral arrows, but again, the last thing right now I need is duplication of items. Unless you can duplicate my diamonds, I mean that that's an option. Found another chest. Uh, I'm not sure how safe this place is, but we're gonna find out if I die. <laughs> All right, another gold block. Really, really nice. What else do we have? Another gold block. Okay, I, I, hmm, 
I can't say no. Another one? I wish it was diamonds we were getting, but I mean, I can't say no to gold now, can I? Alright, grab the hover. Uh, get rid of that, get rid of that. Get the hover. Good. Moving on, I know there's another one down here. Found another chest. Let's see what it contains. More food? I, I won't complain about the food. At all. Uh, Gilded Blackstone. Nah, nah. Nah, nah. I think I'm gonna pass on that. I don't know if people will be annoyed by it, but that is my decision. I really need to be critical with what I'm picking up here. Really critical. Come at me, boy. Come at me. Found another one. Uh, I'll definitely take that. Thank you. Okay, now, now things are starting to get a bit critical. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Uh, I guess at this point I should probably start storing things in blocks. Alright, final chest of this place, I believe. We shall get it. Let's see what we got. Uh, throw that away. Let's see. Arrows, magma cream, another gold block. Iron. And that was it. Alright. That was a very scary journey. Especially because there are gases nearby, so that was a scary journey. Okay, that's both funny and also I love that. <laughs> There's just this very tiny little patch of... I don't remember what this area is called. And then one tree. One tree! I love that. I, I, yep, I love that. Alright, yet another fortress. Same procedure as before. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna go ahead, loot it, and I'll be back if something interesting happens, but again, I'm probably going to mainly keep it to chests. So, stay tuned. I'll be right back. Alright, we found three diamonds in this one chest. Cool. Alright, I think that is this fortress actually all looted out. Alright, well, I'm gonna leave this place and I'll be back at our next location. Aha! We found another Bastion Remnant on the way to the next fortress. Cool. Well, I'll get to it. The usual stuff. Alright, how can I get all that gold? Oh, there's not really any piglins around, so... I should be able to just... take it? I guess? <laughs> this is a lot of gold. If we were able to get glass in the nether, we could make a full, a full, um, a full level beacon, but we can't get glass, so that's a very annoying thing. But hey, we still have the gold for other stuff, <laughs> so that is really cool. All right, yet another fortress. Let's see what it has to offer. Well, I see a chest already. <laughs> Busting in. Ugh. This could be a bad idea. Huh? Nope, we're good. Ah. Well, gonna keep going. Boom! Three more. Ow! Hey! Rude! Three more diamonds. <laughs> nice! Uh, that's. I believe we are missing seven now. <gasps> Never mind! Okay, 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 so. In total, what do we have right now? We have 14, and then I think I have like five in my ender chest. So that's 19. We're missing four, I think. We're just missing four. We're only missing four, guys. Wow. <laughs> that chest had diamonds, and this one had diamonds as well. That is amazing. I am going to make it in the chest right here. I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but in the previous episode, uh, some of you, quite a lot of you actually, uh, mentioned that I could actually um, use the golden pickaxe with silk touch to pick up my ender chest. And that is indeed true. I'm sorry I did not do that. Um, my bad. I did not think that far. I should have, but... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. Oh wait, I'm still missing an ender pearl. Erg, I'm missing an ender pearl. Ah, well, 
Anyways, might as well uh, cook some pork chop up while I'm here in the furnace. But yes, 14 diamonds plus 5 in the ender chest. That equals 19. So we're missing 4 more to get 23. Alright, well this fortress is done. I just gotta get out of here and we'll move on to the next one. Uh, blazes everywhere. Eh. Where did that with a skeleton go? I don't trust you. I don't trust my back either. I don't trust lag. Eh. Let me get out of here. Ah. Bastion Remnant. Alright. I found one. Let's see what we got. We got arrows, iron nuggets, more arrows. Bone blocks I'm not gonna pick up. Uh, iron nuggets, soul speed one. Gold helmet? Yeah, I can do a trade. Sure. I'm not losing my hopper this time. Alright. This time, the hopper stays with me. <laughs> I'm not losing one again. Alright, what do we got? Curse of Vanishing? Interesting. Well, we got food. Oh, was that it? Huh. I guess that was it, huh? Okay. Not much of interest. Ow! Ow! Okay, that scared me a little bit. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm gonna head out of this place because it is pretty dangerous. And... I'm not sure if there are any other chests, but again... A bit dangerous, and I really don't want to die with these 14 diamonds, so... I think I'm going to... Just kindly back off and get out of here. Finally! Got an ender pearl, which means we can now make a ender chest, so we can store these things. <laughs> Not comfortable running around with all this loot. All right, let's do that. I did. Didn't I have five diamonds in this one? I thought I had five diamonds in here. Well then, uh, since we don't have five diamonds, that means we are missing six. Well, that's fine. We are still that much closer. I'm going to keep the blaze rod. I'm going to keep those boots. I'm going to deposit pretty much everything else. I think that right there is pretty good. I'm going to keep the silk touch because now I can pick up the ender chest. Like Suck just did. There we go. That is <laughs> that is a lot better. All right, inventory is a lot cleaner. Let's move on. Smoker to the rescue. And that is a scary amount of hocklands. I do not want to be down there. All right, found another one. Uh, time to make a very scary journey over this lava ocean. Send help. All right, time to loot this place. We only we're only missing six diamonds, so let's hope. Maybe we'll get one that is just like the one that we. Oh, there's already a chest. Eh. Eh. But hey, it's iron. I'll take it. All right, multiple chests located. But as you can hear, there are piglins nearby. So there's a lot of chests here actually, but. As there are a lot of piglins nearby, I will have to use the dropper method because I I really don't want to get in trouble with uh, with piglins because that could be a nightmare. All right, doesn't seem like we have any diamonds in this fortress. It was worth a look though. All right, moving on then. Found another one, and I have a welcoming party: two blazes and a wither skeleton. <laughs> Okay, maybe I can just run. Whoa, that's a big hole. Okay, nope, I can't just run. Never mind. You, sir, please get out of here. Thank you. Uh, uh. Oh dear. Hey, for less. Uh, how about I just. Uh, okay, that's closed. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> Alright. We're. Ooh, chest! We're in. Let's loot this place. Uh, why, why am I doing that? <gasps> Two diamonds! Yes! Okay, we're four down. <laughs> we are four diamonds down. And I want that. Uh, 
yeah, I, no need for the pig, for the harbor trick here because uh, don't don't really have a uh, have any piglins around. At least I don't think so. So we don't need to do that. But yes, two diamonds more. That is good news. Found another one. Three down. Three to go. This is good. We are very close to having all the diamonds. <laughs> okay. Uh, hey, fellas. <laughs> Sneak attack. But yes, as I was saying, we are very close to having all the diamonds that we need. That's very, very good. Two more diamonds. We're missing only one more diamond. One more diamond, and we have all the diamonds that we require. All right. That, I believe, is this fortress completely looted. Well, this is kind of funny. This bastion is of the same design like the first one we raided. That's, that's pretty cool. Of course that is going to happen, but that, that's just pretty cool. Like, I find the exact same, I guess, combination of rooms. Is that how it works? I don't know. But anyways, I'm going to look through this, and in the very end... I believe we have a chest down there. <laughs> so that is cool. I don't remember if there are any chests on these levels, but I guess I'll have a quick look. All right, I do know for a fact that there are chests on like these levels, so that is at least something. Let's see if we get something interesting and worth our inventory space. Crying Obsidian, not bad. Arrows, always useful. Soul Speed 3, yeah, I'll take those. String, Obsidian, Gilded Blackstone, Golden Sword, can't really use the golden sword for anything. Chain, string, crossbow, uh, nothing really of interest. Oh, nothing really of interest. Next. I guess I'll save some of these full, fully uh, crossbows because I guess I'll need new ones later in the future. Huh? I can't take these gold blocks even though I really want to. But I kind of have someone around here that really does not like me stealing gold. So getting the gold blocks here might be a little bit of a pain. I, I can't go through that battle. That is simply not realistic in my uh, armor situation. All right, I think that was the chest in this part. If we move over here now, I think I'm just going to go straight down to that place because... If I recall correctly, I don't think... Oh, actually, I think there might be some chests around here. Aha! I remembered correctly. Though, from the looks of things, it does not look like there are other chests around here, unless I've just misseen something. Well, that was... It's all speed 3. Can't, can't complain. I'm mainly interested in the loot down there, though. Uh, hmm. How, how how get down? How 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 get down? All right. Well, there's a magma spawner right under here somewhere, and I need that gun. Oh dear! Before it spawns too many, please. Can I reach it? Yes, I can. Good. Now I just need to pick these off, one by one, at least so that they're the medium ones, because the big ones do some real pain. <laughs> I don't want to get knocked into lava. That would be very bad. There is just one tiny issue. This is a lot of golden blocks. I want these. Oh, there's two chests. Ooh, fancy. But how do I get these chests? Not chests, sorry. Uh, gold blocks here. Ooh, that's dangerous. Without anchoring all these fellas here. I guess I'm just going to block off 
Yeah, I think this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna block off all of the entrances, so up the bridge, and then I'm basically just going to bridge my way out. I'll just have to use blackstone if it comes to it. <laughs> I, I, I want all that gold. Do I have the iron pickaxe on me? I do indeed. All right, let's get to it. Let's get rid of you. And just gonna block this off like so. I'm just gonna do it three high. I have no idea if it makes a difference. Any other bridges? Nope. Okay. Well, they're gonna hate me. Maybe. Well, right now it doesn't seem like they care. By the sound of things. At all. They don't seem angry. Huh. Well then. Okay. Uh, can I... Oh, it's one of these where I can't get... Hey. Well... Maybe I can then open the chests. <gasps> a diamond sword and ancient debris. Okay. Um. I didn't. I, were you still able to get ancient debris? Wow. I guess I thought that was removed. Huh. Well, we have a we have a damaged iron sword. I mean. It's something, an ancient debris. I mean, can't can't complain about having extra. <gasps> okay, curse of vanishing, but that's still a chest plate. Well, two chest plates. We can repair that into one. All right. So I have been doing some research, some thinking, and also some testing. Basically, get out of here. Yeah. Basically, what we have right here, we have two diamond chest plates. One with the curse of vanishing enchantment. The Curse of Vanishing Enchantment, basically what it does is the item disappears upon death. Which is not really cool. So I don't I don't really want to use this. And we can't just combine these two to make it into one, because the enchantment follows over. But there is something else here. We have a diamond chest plate here. It would take around three diamonds to fully repair this chest plate. Which basically means before we had to use eight diamonds to make a whole chest plate, now we just need three. Basically saves us five diamonds by having this chest plate right here. Ah, where did you come from? Yeah, not okay. All right, thread eliminated. <laughs> but yeah, that saves us five diamonds, which is quite a lot. Now we could also repair the diamond sword, but that would take just as many diamonds, two to three which it's just not really worth it to use two to repair this one when we could make a brand new one and have basically two diamond swords, one having half durability. That would, it would just not be worth repairing this one. But repairing the diamond chest plate, we would save like five diamonds. So we should have enough. We have 22 here. We should have seven back at base. And yeah, I think that should be it. Now do note that uh, if we were to repair this with diamonds, we would need an anvil, which I'm okay making. We have the iron for it. I also have some iron back at base, and I don't really have anything else to use iron for. We're getting all netherite tools and armor, so there's nothing really to make on that front. Guess we could maybe make some things like shears. Do they even have a use down here? I guess maybe they do, I don't remember, but... It's, it's small things, and I would much rather have an anvil. Plus, it would be cool having that very expensive block down here in the nether, especially because iron is so so rare. So having an anvil would be really cool. So yeah, that that's diamond quest complete right there. That that I did not expect it to end like this. <laughs> but yes, that is diamond quest complete. So what's next? In the next episode, we're gonna get fully geared up. In the next episode, we will be back at our good old home base. We will make all the diamond tools and armor and we will convert them all into netherite. It's going to be super satisfying and I just simply cannot wait to do that. But anyways, I'm going to cut it here. I need to get back home to base now with all these things. They're in my ender chest, so even if I die, um, we should be good. <laughs> so that's good. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. I really, really hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you in the next one. Next one is going to be a big, big step. It, it's about time we finally get another right tools and armor. But anyways, hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a wonderful, wonderful day, 
and goodbye.